What's up everybody? Uh, today we are going to be changing the oil on a 2022 Chevy Silverado 2500 with the uh, Duramax 6.6 .6 liter. Uh, you're going to want to check oil right away. That way it'll give you a good idea if you got leaks or anything like that. How's the oil look? The oil's full. Alright, so we got a 15 millimeter wrench on the drain plug. Let's get that drain plug loose. Once you crack it loose, you should just be able to just turn it by hand. Clean it up with, make sure you inspect the threads. Look at the gasket, check for tears in that gasket. This looks pretty new, this one looks good. So we'll let that oil drain for a while. And then we'll get the uh, filter off. Now our oil filter is right to the left of the oil pan right here. For the oil filters, I, I like to use a big channel lock pliers. Once you break her loose with the pliers, you should be able to just unscrew it by hand. Always clean up the mounting surface. You want to make sure that that oil filter gasket wasn't left on there. All right, our new filter. You're gonna to want to just lube up that uh, lube up that O-ring with some fresh oil. Yeah. In a perfect world, you'd want this filled with fresh oil when you install it. But the filter gets installed like that, so you're gonna be dumping it all over your <laughs> all over the ground. So we're just gonna put it in like this. It sh it should be more than fine. So. You want to make sure you get snug it all the way down within a good quarter turn. You know, I usually tighten them by hand. Don't over torque the drain plug. Just take some brake cleaner, spots where we got oil. Make sure you clean it up. You don't want you don't want to do a you don't want to do an oil change, and then have the person come back saying it's leaking after you worked on it. It's just the old oil. Let's climb up here. These trucks get tall in the air, make it uh, difficult to just reach over. If you don't have a funnel handy, just take a razor blade got an old oil container in half like this and that's actually gonna be a great funnel
What is this? Isn't that a funnel? It's an old oil cord. Oh, you already got it. I just cut it and I made my own funnel. Do you want me to Alright, you want to fire it up, then we'll check the oil. Yeah. Alright, shut her, shut her down. We got nine quarts in there, so ran it for a bit. We'll double check the oil, see where we're at. I think it's gonna take that extra quart. The dealership guy gave me 10 quarts. Yeah, we're about a quart low. So we'll put that we'll put that other quart in there. This better be it because that's all the oil they gave me. Oh, they're putting in there. <laughs> you, could, you could still put another half quart in. But we're we're in the hatch marks. So as long as you're in the hatch marks, we're good. Oh the double crosses? Yeah. As long as you're in the operating range, you're not gonna hurt anything. So Alright. There you have it folks. That is how we do uh oil change on a 2022 Chevy Silverado. If you got any kind of value out of this video, please consider liking and subscribing. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.